What's happened, people? Today we're here with Pokemon Sword. So I'm going to cut the formalities uh, short here, but uh, to give you guys uh, this quick, uh, this game I cannot play it while listening, uh, listening while recording at the same time. So unfortunately, I'm gonna have to play this game through preview, and it is going to be delayed for me. So I won't be able to press anything or do anything instantaneously. So I just want you guys to know this beforehand. But uh, I want to thank you guys for really watching this on my channel. Uh, I am really going to get into this game. I cut this game down. Um, I, I didn't cut this game down. No, what? <laughs> it took me a day to play this game. Because I had to learn everything on how to record on the Switch and how to do this. Uh, but now I'm ready. And, uh, oh gosh, it, just, it was just a hassle to get this game going. Because I lost my internet. That's one. Uh... Two, I did know how to stream this on my Switch, and I was dealing with that preview thing. I'm pressing A. Um, I, I was, I was trying to do some stuff here, but, uh, and this is also an example right here. Like I said, it's delayed by three seconds, so I won't be able to press anything instantaneously. And but luckily, it's almost Black Friday, so I will have to buy a new monitor with a um. Oops, oh, wait a second. <laughs> I forgot. I'm only using, oops, one side of my joystick. Actually, oh man, let me take this out. Uh, I'm using this like on a like, controller mode. Oh man, this is such a hassle and, and unprofessional. I'm sorry. Oh man, um, it's just that this is really difficult. Like I said, uh, this is all delayed. I'm playing this game through preview. It is a terrible experience on uh, in playing this game for me because I really want to get into this game and enjoy it as fullest. But unfortunately, until I buy a new monitor, uh. Oh god, I'm going to have to deal with this. Name myself Player. Oh shit. So yeah, everything's delayed, unfortunately. I will get through it though. So uh, here we go. Not YouTube. You see. Welcome and all. Welcome to the wonderful world of Pokemon. Are you the professor? No, you're not. That was a lady. Our beloved Galar region is a wonderful place with thriving nature. Beautiful cities and many Pokemon which with which we share our lives. As you know, our society is able to thrive. Whoa. You're new? Thanks to the help thanks to the help of these mysterious creatures we call Pokemon. Yes, Pokemon are all around us, in the sea, in the sky, and even with us in our towns. And those of us who choose to raise and train Pokemon to do battle and compete. We call Pokemon we call Pokemon trainers. <laughs> okay. Oh, but I'm getting carried away. Please allow me to introduce myself. Yes, who are you? My name is Rose. It is a pleasure to be here. <laughs> now turn your gaze to the Galar region's greatest Pokemon trainer, our undefeated champion. It's time for Champion Leon's ex Exposition Match. Oh, I heard about this guy. Crazy powerful, aren't you? And his feet weren't planted on the ground. <laughs> exhibition or not, Leon, you're 
present uh, record is now. Okay. I know I don't know. I know I don't lose battles. Charts are Dynamax. Sorry, this is all delayed, like I said. I forgot your name. Where are you, a bubble? I'm not gonna lie, these graphics are decent. What's you doing? What are you doing? Hello, hello. Just roll up in my house. Oh, <laughs> that your flash new phone player? That your flash new phone player? What's a flash new phone? Were you watching Lee's exposition match on it? But you can't cheer him on with your hands full. You know, the only way to properly cheer on Lee would be with his famous Charizard pose. Uh. What is he talking about? Huh, didn't expect to see you here today. Dear? Isn't this a big day? Isn't this the big day? Hop didn't expect to see you here today, dear. Isn't this the big day? Yeah, that's exactly why I came running over here to get play up. Which is Mike. Never mind watching the match now. I've got a recording at home anyway. I record all my brother's matches. Go with me, player. We should be here. He should be here any minute. And Lee always brings presents when he visits, so I wouldn't forget that bag if I were you. Now, I've got to run. See you at Mine Lair. At Mine? I'm going to his house? I'm just chilling there with the phone. I can't. Okay, I'm moving. Just all delayed. This is going to be a nightmare. Uh, how do most? I'm pressing other buttons. Oh. So this is the town and everything as of now. It's not showing me anything more. I could probably scroll up, but I'm not going to. Do that. Sorry, that's my phone. I'm going to move this. Text speed fast. Actually, well, I'm gonna keep it normal because this is delayed. Send the boxes. This is me. You can choose to have Pokemon automatically sent to your boxes or not when your party is full. Oh. Okay, that can do that. Give nicknames. I don't usually give Pokemon nicknames. Okay, I'm not scrolling up twice. Okay, my phone's on mute. Um, gyroscope? What's, oops, what the? Can I use both? This one has like a little D-pad. Give it the names. Okay, it's turned on. Okay, no. Okay. Uh, don't. I, I don't even know why that's an option. Oh, uh, not yet. Gyroscope. Oops. It's doing that for some reason. I'm not even holding it down like that. You can choose whether you wish to use the gyroscope for cam controls in the Pokemon camp. What is that? I don't know what that is. I'll save on casual controls. This mode makes it easier to play with one hand. Okay.
You can choose whether you wish to skip movies. Uh, no, I'm good. Okay, that's it for settings. What else am I doing? Um, I'm moving. Whoa. You're a little fast, aren't you? It's a Moblex. Oh my gosh, you're fast. Don't run. Good baby steps. So I have to go upstairs, most likely. Is that my mother? Rushing off to that... Rushing off to in that state, player? Didn't Hop say you should bring your bag? That's where I'm headed. I last, uh, last saw it in your room. And don't forget to grab a hat for the weather. What you mean? We're not wearing jackets. Are we? Actually, no, I saw him wearing a jacket. This is my room? You grab your dad's old bag? Don't you have your own? That's the first reference of a dad I ever saw in Pokemon, in a Pokemon game. Adventure guide. Open next. Okay, I already did that. I already did that. Oh wow, look at this guy's room. We got a switch right there. Why is it black and green? By the telly? Is that what you call it? It's a simple desk that you can keep. Okay. Uh, obviously, there's nothing else in this room. I thought there was like some PC I can get to for a potion. Do they still have that? Oh my gosh, it's pretty annoying. Yeah, I can't. Okay, no PC. Uh, uh, no PC. Okay, I'm dressed. But remember, no going into the forest. Okay. I guess I had to get her approval before I do anything. Is the potion already inside here? Yes, it is. What's this? Adventure's Guide. A compact device that automatically collects and records advice when a trainer is out on an adventure. Um, clarify for me. Like what? Oh, just like the thing that just showed up. All right, that gives me some, that gives me some uh, fire red leaf green vibes. Except more useless. Pressing A at the door does to get closer. This is the door, right? There's... I see jackets right there. Hooks. Oh my god. Wait, is this the door? Oh, that's her room? I'm confused. That's a nice crib, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> Look at all the grass there, it looks nice. And that's a view do. Oops. Can you please love a god? But hey, look at you, player. That old bag looks like it could pull you over. At least we know that it should hold anything leave my brain. Even if even if it's a big ass a Snorlax. Jeez, why are you making fun of my bag? A wool. Oh, it's a wool. Uh, wool. What did I call it before? Uh, but that's. But what is it doing there? It's tackling that fence. You silly Wooloo. I see that what you're up to. Don't go using tackle on that fencing. 
Now you listen. No going past that fence. No. Everyone knows they are scary Pokemon living in the slumbering world. We eld. We eld. Is that what you call it? But it's like, meh. Now you listen. Now that's taken care of. How about I play it? Let's race. But I can make it to my house first. With you holding that old bag around. Stop roasting my bag, bro. That one's just rolling with me. Is that his Pokemon? This one just roll around getting everywhere. Oh, snap. The fat guy. Yep, that's what I thought. The fat guy talks about science. They're gonna give him some purpose in this game eventually. They bring him out in every single game. Oh, look at that. The guy's on that little fence. I mean, that, um. A stone gate? I'm not sure what you call that. Hey, player, Hop was looking for you, you know. But no need to go to the next town to find him when he lives right next door, does he? Oh, okay, okay, okay. Oh, gosh. Oop. Wait, can I get through? Okay. I just walked right in here. Uh, I must have came with him? I don't know. Mom, is he here? Oh my gosh, that's why I call my mom. There you are at last, Hop. You name your son that. Oh, you've brought along Playa. Hello, dear. Yeah, yeah, but where is Lee? Have you got him cramped in a cupboard? He's still not here yet. For the hundredth time, honestly, hot. You must learn some patience. <laughs> He's probably only just arrived at the station in Wedgehurst. Then that's where I'm going. You know Lee is hopeless with directions. I make sure he doesn't get lost on the way. Oh, will you? Yes, that would probably be for the best. You've got to come with, Playa. you still never met my big bro, right? I haven't, even though he lives here too properly. You can't miss out on a chance to meet the and defeat a champion. I wait for you uh, out on the routes. Let me talk to your mother real quick. Hello, dear. Let me get to know you better, girl. Go on with Hop and pick up Leon, won't you? Playa, I know you're the reliable sort. I have everything ready for a barbecue in the garden by the time you're all back. A barbecue? Hey! What's going on here? Whoa, is that the Pops? To Hop, his brother is a hero. Really, I can see that with all these trophies here. Oops. There are books about the champion? Books? I don't see books, I see trophies. Oh, never mind. There is books. Can I... Does that trophy say anything specifically on what... He won. All these trophies belong to the champion. So he does live here. It's a purloin. Why do you have a bone stick when that's a purloin? Or that, like, what do you call that? Shoot, I don't know what that is, but it's not for dogs. What's this? Hey, this man's room is popping. Is 
with the little posters on groom bed. I cannot talk myself, bro. Yeah, I definitely can't talk. Okay. Oh yeah, let me talk to you. Leon is so busy that he hardly comes home, but I would like to keep his room clean and tidy. I got a lot of hats. Maybe working out too? That's cool. This room is nice. Got boxes everywhere. Ma what are these magazines? Hmm, suspicious. But he has a lot of hats though, I'm not, I'm not gonna lie. Jesus. Oh, oh, nope. That's not where I meant to go. I'm rushing on walls and whatnot. This is very difficult to uh, control this. But I love the detail into the housings. Sure, they don't have bedrooms for the old folks and the mother, but uh, I don't know. It looks like something you would see. Oops. Let's get a move on. Only. Only remember, player. Wild Pokemon could come out of nowhere if you walk through patches of tall grass. I've got my Wooloo with me, so I'm ready for battles against Wild Pokemon, of course. But not you, player. So we'll steer clear of all to grass as we go. Can she just cover for me if any Pokemon do attack me? I'll just walk with you, right? Okay, he. Yeah. Route 1. Here he is. And music. Oops. Uh, this would be so much better if I wasn't playing like this. Let's go and meet Lee at the station. It's dead. Why don't you know? I could actually play the game undelayed if I do this. So that's why I can still hear it, but the audio is going to be delayed. Okay, so now I can look at it. Okay, now we're good. No wondering. No wondering in this holograph. Okay, bud. Alright, that's a lot better. I see, I can I can control it now. That sucks. I want to walk in the tall grass and get myself killed. I'm kidding. Yeet. Don't do it. He poses. You just do that right there in public? Can't you keep that for the camera, brother? Hello, hello, Wedgehurst. Your champion, Leon, is back. I promise I'll keep doing my best to deliver the greatest battles for you all to watch. It's our unbeatable champion, Leon. You and Charizard are the greatest. Well, thank you for that. I hope we'll all carry on training up your Pokemon. I hope you'll, you'll all carry on training up your Pokemon and never shy from battles. Then come challenge me for the champion title. We're on it. We've got all we all been working on our battle skills just like you taught us to Leo. But that charger of yours is too strong for the likes of us to take on. True it's too true that Charger is blazingly strong. <laughs> but other Pokemon can be strong as well. That's why I want the strongest of challengers to fill the gym gym challenge to come battle with me. Uh, against me. My wish is for Galar's trainers to work together to become the strongest in all of the world. Growl. Lee. This is his brother. So, my number one fan is all... My number one fan in all the world has come out of his way to pick me up. Look at you, Hawk. I reckon you've grown. Exactly an inch in a quarter since the last time I saw you. Bingo, that's the sort of sharp eye that's kept you undefeated so long, eh, Lee? Of course, that's um, the same animation Hal has in Once on the Moon. And these bright eyes over here. Um, guys, you must be player, am I right? I've heard loads about you from my little brother. I'm the Galar region's greatest ever Pokemon champion, and a massive Charizard fan, too. I can see that. People call me the Undefeated 
Leona. Okay, I don't know you at all. Come on, Lee. And you, player. But I bet I can beat the both of you back home. Bad Hawk, always wanting to be the best, isn't he? With a proper rival on his own. A pro with a proper rival of his own. Oh, I said it right. I bet he pushed himself to become something truly special. Well, everyone, I bid you farewell for today. But don't lose your fret. I'll always be around to make sure everyone in Galar can have a champion time. His cape looks pretty cool with all those logos. Sorry. Come on, Lee. You promised us a present, so out with it. You brought play in me Pokemon. You did, didn't you? I know you must have. Right then, the greatest gift from the greatest champion. It's showtime, everyone. So what are you gonna give us? Take a good look, you two. So I don't get the Pokemon from the Professor, the champion himself. And here are the stars. So, Score Bunny. And I forgot the rest because Score Bunny was the most hypnotized. These <laughs> Pokemon are already running inside their natural habitat. Line up, everyone. Which will you choose? Hmm. I'm choosing first? Well, obviously I am, but... Go on, you pick first. I've already got my Wooloo, after all. Huh. I don't know. Scorbunny. Scorbunny is a fire type. It's filled with bursting with fiery passion. You're set on the fire type Pokemon Scorbunny? It's natural you want to consider your options. So, going with your instincts is fine as well. You choose your dear partner however you like. This is gonna be confusing. <sighs> Excuse me. Uh, so, should I pick the water type, fire type, or grass type? And I feel like I am going to choose... Everyone picks Score Bunny. And obviously that Pokemon looks really cool and I do like it. Um... Problem is... I don't... The Pokemon looks cool, it's just that, I don't know, I don't... want a fire type this time around. What was the, la what was the last Pokemon I picked? Sun Moon, it was, um... Incineroar. Ah. Uh, so it was either Grass or Water for this time around. So I guess I'm going to choose... The Water type. What did I pick it back in... X and Y? Water type? Greninja? I think so. I think I pick it. Okay, no, F it. Water type it is. That's the water type Sobble. It adapts to anything. As surely as water flows. Going with the water type Pokemon Sobble? Why not? You choose Sobble. So, it will be Sobble for you. Nice one. Then I'll go with Score Bunny. You're mine. I'm aiming to be the next champion, so be ready. You and I will be doing some serious training. I bet you will be hot. That poor grass type. <laughs> oh man. That's why I brought along these Pokemon for you. For you and player. So, the two of you can bow and train and grow stronger together to try and reach me.
and I'll and you'll come with me. Charizard will show you the ropes. He's strict, but real strong and real kind too. So he's gonna shoot the grass type, alright. Alright, enough of all this trainer nonsense for one night. Darren's ready, children. Bring along your Pokemon and let's all eat. She's got a barbecue going on, that's awesome. Dude, that's a huge sister kebab. At least I didn't leave the grass type left out. <laughs> I was about to say. The next day. You spent the whole night with that new partner of yours, right, Hop? You two getting along alright? Understanding one another? Maybe even built up a bit of love? Of course I have, Lee. Players made fast friends with his sobble, too. I haven't even. Okay. <laughs> then let's up new trainers. Believe in yourself and your Pokemon. If you trust in one another and carry on battling side by side long enough, then someday you might even become worthy rivals for me, the unbeatable champion. Were you looking? Were you you looking at him for me? I'm one who will be coming to challenge you. <laughs> Why is he looking at me? If you think Player might be able to challenge you, then I guess he's my first rival. But I'm not planning to lose to him and miss out on my chance to beat the unbeatable champion. Just having a Pokemon with you doesn't make you a real trainer, you know. Proper trainers raise Pokemon up to be first rate in battle too. And oh, and you think you're worthy of calling yourself such a proper trainer already, huh? Guess I'll be the judge of that. Let's see how you handle yourself in a battle against your friend if he's up for it. What do you say, willing to re ready and willing to ready and take on the hop? On your first ever Pokemon battle of your life? Not really. That's not the first battle, but okay. Leaving your partner Pokemon. And carry for them. And care for them, too. With all your hearts. All this idealistic stuff. Do these two things, and I'm certain you, you'll learn to choose the moves that suit your Pokemon. And more importantly, you'll have a champion time battling with you. They have a champion time battling with you? Looks like everyone's on board. Pokemon and trans alike. Then let's do this. Could you have to stop announcing stuff? Man, you're talking to two individuals. I've watched every match that these ever had. I've read every book and magazine he left behind at home, too. Okay. I know exactly what to do in order to win. Well, calm your titty, sir. Wait, I'm facing two, but one with one? I'm putting on the battle it is then. I got two partners with me. Oh, you're level three. You're not even that strong, buddy. How do you have this Pokemon, but it's only level three, sir? I do have a potion, so I'm pretty decent. Boy, you just weak. They didn't even give me water gun though. They used did that with the previous game, right? Yeah, they did with um I remember they did with Old Mega Ruby Alpha Sapphire and X and Y, right? That's Wulu down. And XP. Oh, level up! Oh, water gun! Okay, I can see you basically do get it. <laughs> It's not over yet. I've added another worthy ally to my team. Oh, rip. That score by look at it bounce them around like that. That's actually adorable. And here's the uh, overworld of the battle. That's pretty cool. I like these um, angles. Do you already know about type advantages? Oh wow, that's a cool animation when it comes at you like that. That's cool. At least they have animations for that, but not double kick. Oh, I thought you would die from that. Now, how am I faster than you? Oh, suppose I chose the fastest star of them all. It kind of makes a little sense that a bunny is less faster than. 
iguana slash lizard salamander. Thing. Oh, two levels, wow. You beat my two Pokemon with just with just your own? Oh my bad. You beat my two Pokemon with your one? That's is that improper grammar? You and that Sobble are too much. Well, that was a shock. Guess I know how. I guess I know now why Lee thought he should give you a Pokemon too. You and your Pokemon all fought hard. Maybe almost want to let out Charizard and join in all the fun. Can you put that Charizard away and use your other Pokemon? Can you just grab that little uh, grass type? Grab her out there, Sobble. Or no, I get you uh, all sorted. Good effort out there, Sobble. Make it sorted and play it. You got real promise. In fact, I got a favor to ask you. Be a real rival to Hub, would you? Push him and make sure that both of you get stronger. I already want to get stronger and stronger. You see me in battle now, Lee. So come on. You got to let me take on the Pokemon gyms. Yeah, just do that. Why do you need him to tell you that? You join the gym ja uh, gym challenge. You think you're ready for the single greatest competition in the Galar region? Not putting the cart before the Rapidash there, little brother. Not putting the cart before the Rapidash? There, little brother. It, what kind of saying is that? Is I, re I don't know what reference that is. If <laughs> that's what you want to do, you two have a whole lot, a whole lot you need to learn about Pokemon. Especially your friend Play, excuse me. Before you think about getting gym badges, best to think about getting a Pokedex. I don't need that thing. A generous Pokedex helps them learn lots about things about all the Pokemon out there, including their strengths. But if there's more, but there's more than just that. It, wait, but it's more than just a collection of data, you know. It's a record of a trainer's love and passion for Pokemon training. That's metaphorically correct. Right, right. We get it. Pokedexes. Then we're on it. Looks like it's off to the Pokemon Research Lab for you and me, player. That's the kind of enthusiasm a trainer needs. I'll let the professor know to respect me. I'm going to be the next next champion, so completing a simple Pokedex is nothing. Just another page in the tale of my legend. You probably better go tell your mum that you're headed out, though. Yes, I know I have to tell her. My poem was healed, right? He healed it. Awesome. Oh, wow, that's a little visual on it right here. That's cool. So, you are male? Yeah, your speed stat's not bad. Special attack is good, too. This one is pretty mild by nature. Okay. Crash. What the happened? Malaya, <laughs> do you hear that just now? The gate's open, and that Wulu that was there. He must have crashed through. It was tackling the fence pretty hard earlier. I don't think it actually broke through there. Do you? You don't think it broke through there? Do you? Not you don't think it broke through there, do you? But it's off limits. Nobody's supposed to go there. I remember the professor granddaughter went in once, and she came back in a real state. And that was nothing compared to, to the earful she got from the professor afterward. Playa, what do you say? We've got to save this. Right, even if we're not supposed to, this is the kind of sense where you simply have to do something that's needed. What's needed? I don't know. I hope you're raised for anything, because we're going in, Playa. We, should, we have Pokemon, so, like, it shouldn't be that, you know. Come on, Playa. You can't just leave the Pokemon on its own. Oh, yeah, okay. So, we go over here. Slumbering Wield. Wield, right? Slumbering Wield is what you call it. That Wooloo. Where do you think it went off to? Why are you always smiling? I'm not realizing that now. Even in that crisis, you were smiling, right? The bug is really coming on thick now. If we don't find that Pokemon soon, this might be trouble. He's always smiling. This is just like what back in X and Y. The trainer was always smiling in every situation. It was just unrealistic and poor attention to detail. 
I find this to be almost the same. You captured a... Whoa, who are you? Well, music actually sounds pretty decent. It's delayed for me, but it sounds pretty decent. I'm gonna fight you, bro. I would capture you, but, uh, goodbye. He can give me Pokeballs when I'm entering this forest, man. What if I wanted that little guy? Oh, you can do... Wait. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, wow. They have this little feature... Wait, wait, wait. Was this a feature back in Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu? I don't remember, but I think it was, right? That's cool, though. You can sneak in the grass to prevent... So it's basically a repel. Doing all right there, Sobble? Let's be sure you're on tip-top shape. Oh, he healed my Pokemon. Not bad. I could have grinded right in that grass, kind of. Something I wasn't going to do. I already know this game is going to be easy. I don't need to uh, grind my Pokemon. Oh, Kidi. Music in this game is pretty cool. A nerve? Oh, well. So I can't use berries. So far, I'm enjoying the game. I'm not seeing anything, anything uh, critical or any criticism to never escape on it. Go ahead and sneak. Actually, you can also do this in Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire. I forgot about that. But I forgot how it truly worked. Um, you snuck around when you were trying to do something in the game. I forgot what it was exactly. I think it was the same mechanic where you go in the grass. Do you hear that? Was that the Pokemon's crying out, do you think? I don't know. This music is delayed for me, bro. Oops. If I walk fast in the grass, it keeps doing that. I keep forgetting. I'm not gonna lie, this bag on my back is uh, pretty crazy. Can I see quickly like that? And it will still have the same effect, or the slower I go, the more or less uh, Pokemon in capture me. Come on, player. That Wooloo might be in the real trouble. Well, he went into that fog. I can't even see him now. We shouldn't be getting split like that, but okay. Jesus, this is getting thick. Actually, I shouldn't be saying Jesus in the Pokemon game, should I? This is mad. I can't even see my own hand in front of my face. I think I... I think I get now why this place is off limits. We can seriously get lost in this place. Oh, look! There he is! My trainer actually has an expression on his face. And so does he. Okay. Okay. What the... What in the... The what? What, 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 what? A poem with that name disappeared, and I think we all know who that is. We don't know what's the level. We don't know anything about it, and we're battling it? This is crazy. The move had no effect? This one with the Smear Series? Put one gauges it fixes along you. What, the move had no effect on it? Yeah, I don't know what's going on here, Bradley. How about physical attacks? Not even that. Now the mist got cloudier. Play, I can't see anything. You okay? <coughs> oh boy. Why, more info. Oh, that's, that's info on my moves. I can lower its attack? What can, I, what, what can that do? It had no effect. Now the cloud is just... The fog is just... Unseeable. 
Am I still gonna be able to bow like this? I can't see anything. Oh, whoa. Oh, that was crazy. I'm just out there fainting. Where's my star Pokemon? I didn't return into the Pokeball, did I? Or... Hop, player. Leon? He's here? What? Lee? How you managed to find your way here? Your... Your pants with directions. You always get lost. Oh, that's nice to hear from the little brother who had me worry sick. I've been waiting ages for you two, and you never showed. Of course, I came looking for you both. Wait, where's the Wulu? We were trying to rescue that Wulu. Oh, they found it. Meh. The little champ's just fine. Though all of you had fainted by the time I found you here. You know, this place is out of bounds. But it took courage to come here all the same. And I understand well enough why you did it. You did good, Hot. And at least that Wu is alright. Yeah, player? I thought we had it when that weird fox started rolling in and that mad Pokemon attacked it. But at least it wasn't all for nothing. Attacked by some mad Pokemon? What are you talking about, Hot? It seemed a little stronger than any Pokemon I have ever seen. And it just had this sort of presence. Our moves didn't even touch it. I mean, really. They seemed to pass right through it. Your moves pass it right through it. So the fierce Pokemon they say live in the slumbering weird. Weird. <laughs> Are they actually illusions or something? Get strong enough that maybe the two of you could, could be the ones to reveal the truth someday. But now it's simply... Not, for now, let's simply get out of this place. Uh, you'll be alright now that I'm here with you. Even if we do get on earful, earful from Lee, what an experience. This will make a, a pretty fine first page in the tale of my legend. I don't care about your legend, bro. Can we just get out of here? Don't forget to tell your mom we're head off. She'll go. She'll go spare. She'll go spare if you leave without a weir, A word. She'll go spare if you leave without a word. What's spare me? I mean. What does that mean? Is that a metaphor? Even worse than Lee just did. Should go spar? Spare? Oh, did I say spar? I mean spare? Oh man, I meant spar. My bad. There's the Munchlax. Shouldn't that be my Pokemon? What? <laughs> now, isn't Swallow just a sweetheart? Did you see it at the barbecue? And yes, I heard the news from the young Leon. I'm glad everyone bothered bother to tell me. Off the wedge house, Wedgehurst, aren't you? Here you are, a bit of pocket money for your drink, thank you. Buy yourself a buy yourself a little something for that Pokemon from the Pokemon Center. Maybe some potions or something. Remember that Subo will bow to the very end for you. So don't you go pushing the poor gear too hard. Can I walk around with this Pokemon? They have animations for all Pokemon to stand right. What? And you, Subo, look after my little player. Go home for, come home to rest anytime you need. After all, east or west, home is best. Oh, that's funny. I don't remember that. Whether you go what east or west, home is best. That's um. I'll keep that metaphor. Can I catch these things or? Got a bunch of Pokemon here, and they're not even mine. So. Those Butterfreeze and those Wooloos. These Wooloos are everywhere. But anyways, I'm going to start, stop, save right here. And uh, continue the adventure some other time later. So thank you guys for watching, and we'll be back. Peace.